Hi everyone and welcome back. In Ephesians chapter 6 verse 15, Paul says that we as Christians need to have our feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace. Now the context he is talking about is the Roman soldier and the, his armor that he had to wear. And now he's talking about his footwear. And we know historically that the Roman footwear consisted of the solid piece of le leather under which there were the steel knobs and on top were the straps that held their feet in place. Now, interestingly, when those shoes went on, they stayed on. Not like you and I, we go to bed at night, we take our shoes off and put another pair of shoes on in the morning. No, they were always ready for battle. They would never take those shoes off once they were on. They were prepared. And that speaks of an attitude of heart that each and every one of us, we always need to prepare, be prepared. We also see that those steel uh, knobs on the bottom stopped their feet from slipping and sliding, made them secure, gave them a good traction. They could, they could stand and, and be established. That speaks to us. The, the, the light leather work, the straps, speak about a shoe that is light, not a shoe that is heavy, cumbersome. Talking about an attitude of heart that we need to have where we're not held back by heavy problems and pressures and heavy commitments, but we're able to move and we're able to be quick and to serve the Lord and to respond to whatever God wants of us in any different situation. When these shoes were put on the soldier, he was ready for battle. And that's what God is expecting of you and I. Now, they are the preparation of the gospel of peace. That's what Paul says. And you see, this peace is so important. We need to have peace with God. We need to have peace with people, other people. And we need to have peace with ourselves. So when you go to the shop and you find a pair of shoes that you like and you put your feet in them and you find that mm, they're a little bit tight, they're pinching a little bit on the toes, but I'm sure they'll be fine. And the longer you wear them, the worse they become. So it's the same with God. When you are disturbed in your heart and you're not at peace with Him, don't continue, don't persist. Sort out the issue, whatever it is. Bring your heart to God and say, Lord, what's going on here? When you're at, at odds with a person, a brother or a sister or a member of your family or somebody in the church, in the same way, find out the situation, sort it out, find the peace of God and find peace with yourself. Keep your heart well and open to God. Make sure you have the right shoes that fit well. The gospel of peace. God bless. Thank <laughs> you.